we are making a busy living. A busy life makes us only see a hand. It is making our life is stopping. On this account, we mainly forgetting our precious things. So we plan two projects. Project Huyo and Project Gungji. Project Huyo. Modern popular culture is growing consistently and receiving many people's interest. Also, the public enjoys the culture takes watching the charged performance for granted. But how about Fuga? Korean traditional music Fuga is being forgotten behind the popular culture and other performance cultures. Have you heard this feeling? We must keep this sound. We must keep Fuga. We We decided to draw a plan to, the, to have the traditional fuga not forgotten by helping the Janchi Madang. The Janchi Madang is a punk rock band located in Bukyeong, which was founded in 1992. But it is being forgotten from people's memories, so it has a lower awareness. The Janchi Madang has a several profit problems. First, the audience cannot understand the performance easily. 38% of Chan Chimata audience expresses a dissatisfaction in performance information. Second, the Persian are free audience. Almost 70% of the audience are invited audience or free ticket audience. The rate of the high free ticket audience become a cause of the performance profit reduction, so the Chan Chimata rely on the government subsidy. About 97% of one-year profit of Chan Chimadang are operated by the government subsidy. This profit structure makes an instability of the profit. So we thought about the plan to inform Chan Chimadang and make stable profit structure. We saw the promotion for domestic performance to serve the instability of the profit. To promote the domestic performance, we have two plans. First, video performance comprehension. comprehension. Second, image production. First, we made a video to raise the comprehension of the performance. The audience's comprehension of the performance rose by 20% due to this video and the performance satisfaction increased. Also, we plan in a straight to lay the awareness of the Chan Chimadang and promote Kuga. Busking is street performance that the Chan Chimadang and College Puma Club are playing together. Also, we play Collage and Flash Mob. We decided to recycle the discarded instrument and activate Ongo Jackson, which was new professors. We also focused on the useless instrument being thrown away. Average 50 discarded instruments per out a year from 22 Pungmul groups in Bupyeong. Total number of the discarded instruments in Bupyeong is 1,100. This discarded instrument causes a disposal cost problem and environmental problem. The Chanchi Madang was trying to solve the environmental problem of discarded instrument by a redesign project named Ongo Jackson in 2012. But the number of artists participating in Ongo Jackson was only 10 person and they just focused on art industry. So Ongo Jackson sells just two products. We decided a business model. 
that could solve the environment problem and make a stable profit structure by activating Ongojakshin. Step one, motivation. Step two, network. Step three, innovation. Step four, retail. Step five, independence. First, we should expand artists. So, we formed a partnership with, with the art college in Sangmeng University. We made a subject through a conversation with Sangmeng University Art College. And around 30 students participated in the discarded instrument redesign. So, we focused on the furniture market, not the artwork. The art of the market was constantly releasing, but the home decoration market was constantly increasing. We made an idea to redesign this kind of instrument into furniture. This idea has the constant business model and the Sangmei University student joined the furniture. These changes will establish, these changes will accelerate constant profit. We have retail plan. We utilize the pre market exhibition and internet in order to sell Ongojakshin products and verify its business value. Next, through the furniture network with furniture market, we create a new market. And we create a distribution channel that sold just on Gojakshin brand. Promotion for domestic performance. On Gojakshin. Using these two ways, we serve unstable profit and discard traditional instrument problem. We will let people don't forget our traditional music and establish the durability of the Kuga groups. We are Project Hoya. There are people who cultivate and hone only a single skill that has been developed for a generation. We call them master craftsmen. The craftsmen have existed over various fields. They had pride in the skills they possess. People also admitted them with respect. However, as a large scale capital emerged along with factories, Many products were supplied at a more affordable prices. The products are made by craftsmen that were created with effort, could only fall behind in the competition, and many of them lost their position. We designed the project Gunji in order to retrieve the lost pride of decreasing craftsmen and help them stand on their own feet. The first target for Project Gengji is the only craftsman in our country making handmade soccer shoes, Oma Kim. He has committed himself only to creating soccer shoes for 40 years and his skills also let him create the under-17 North Korean women's soccer team. In addition, he is secure at helping many people who cannot enjoy ordinary factory-made football boots. He has two problems. First, you do say. Second, no self confidence. You do say. The profits. His annual revenue are approximately 8 million won, but profit are 25 million won. The profit structure that he has can be divided in a process in the order of promotion, order, manufacture, and sales. There are two main causes for the craftsman lacking revenue. Within this process, the circumstance is insufficient to prepare the, the craftsman full capacity and skill, and this leads to decrease in quality compared to his skill. Second, the order and manufacturing process is inefficient, while there is no marketing strategy 
without word of mouth. That is why our enactors team went through three stages to solve these problems, developing new design, promotion, and education. Football boots are comprised of the stud and the leather of gold. Football boots, the stud are much more important. The reason behind this is because the stud allow players to move best without slipping by appropriately maintaining friction between the ground and the sole. In However, the craftsman couldn't make his own stud. In order for the craftsman had to make the stud he had to design, he had to make the actual model going through multiple changes. This complicated process was very costly. As a result, all this time, the craftsman has implemented the method of buying stud from outside source and then applying the letter he had made to make his football boots. The method didn't allow him to fully utilize his skill. So we went through two stages to solve this problem. First, we turned our focus to 3D printing. We used a 3D printer so he could make a small scale model of the stud that he had designed. This process allowed him to come up with the perfect design that he had in mind more efficiently. In addition, the cost of design that would have been spent in the Dysinger factory was reduced drastically. We established a partnership. We emphasized a social contribution that he made by making customized purples for people who are uncomfortable with factory-made ones. The association, who had a contract with a Dysinger factory, decided to make his stuff at a lower 50. The craftsman had made football boots for a long time alone. Therefore, his older system was inefficient and complicated. We followed up on those points and resulting in the work efficiency of the craftsman. We contact Chairman Hyung Woo, who is internationally famous in the field of freestyle football. From now on, through promotion in freestyle content and advertising video from Chairman Woo, we will expand our extend the product influence in the market. Also, we will provide customized soccer boots to people through a mobile website, Flea Market. It will enable for a change in the previously passive method, which only cared for customers that came to the store. By actively approaching the customers and communicating with them, we will adopt a method that is more satisfying. The toy craft man had only focused on making football boots, so his knowledge in business was poor. So we provide education on sales, ed sales marketing, and communication with customers through website. The target craft man is proactively coming up with opinion on how to develop Xinjiang sports. Low self confidence. Also, the craft man had committed himself to making purple boots for the past 40 years, but he did not receive treatment he deserved. This is why we turn ourselves to Korea Craft Master System. Craft Master System will allow him to feel pride in his work. Also, the 20 million won given by government grants will be important funding for his work. He is now no longer a torpedo craftsman worrying about going out of business. He now has hope. He has witnessed possibility. He will now propel forward independently with high hope for a better future. We are Project Gungji. We remind for 
God in things. Look at the opportunity. Giving a boost to traditional music. Giving a boost to craftsmen. You should remember. We share our heart through this world. We can develop our culture. We are in that town. Thank you, thank you for the presentation team. You have to remind the blind condition which you cannot identify your institution name. Please remind that. And we will now begin our question and answer period. Only Joyce may ask questions. 네, 똑같이 한글로 Q&A 진행하도록 하겠습니다. 네, 일단 그두 번째 프로젝트 같은 경우에 예, 지금 해서 결과적으로 수익이 전환이 된게 있는지 이 땅은 얼마가 전환이 된 건지 궁금합니다. 아, 네, 감사합니다. 저는 팀 멤버 김영재라고 합니다. 어, 그 부분에 대해서 말씀드리면 저희가 지금 이 프로젝트를 기획한 것은 한 6개월 정도로 저희가 지금까지 했던 것은 대상자와의 인파먼트 관계 단계에 많이 있었고요. 지금부터 이제 저희가 수익을 계산하기 위해서 7월, 7월 13일, 18일 정도에 저희가 지금 프리마켓이나 이런 걸 통해서 이분들의 제품이나 판매를 하고 또 홍보도 같이 진행하면서 수익을 좀 높여갈 계획입니다. 감사합니다. 네, 발표 잘 들었습니다. 그두 번째 프로젝트 중에 명장 제도를 어, 도입했다고 했는데 이게 어떤 가치가 있는지 그리고 뭐 어디랑 하는 건지 그러니까 이 명장을 뭐 받았을 때는 어떤 베네핏이 있는 건지 좀 궁금합니다. 아, 네. 그것에, 그 부분에 대해서는 어, <웃음> 그 명장 제도에 일단 명장이 되시게 되면 일단 2천만 원이라는 그 일시 장려금이 지급이 되고요. 그걸 통해서 그분이 사회적으로 뭔가 지위나 이런 것들이 좀 높아, 높아진다고 저희가 생각을 했고 그리고 지금 이분이 이 장인분께서 지금 사회적인 뭐 직업에 대한 인식이나 이런 것들이 되게 안 좋아서 그런 부분이 좀 사회적인 그런 프라이드가 좀 많이 높아지지 않을까 라는 생각이 좀 하고 있습니다. 호연에 대한 질문입니다. 아, 호연에 대해서는 이제 그 불완전한 수익을 높이기 위해서 여러 가지 이제 액티비티를 많이 했는데 그 액티비티를 이제 기획팀에서 같이 하시는 걸로 알고 있고 그리고 대상이 되는 분들도 같이 이제 그걸 보고 듣고 따라할 거다 이렇게 생각을 하는데 어, 지금 계신 분들이 나가고 나면 그 호여, 아, 원래 있던 그 전통 콩물 잔치마다 어, 이분들이 혼자서 그런 것들을 어, 기획하고 앞으로도 계속 할수 있는 지속 가능성이 있는지 거기에 대해서 네, 저는 호연 프로젝트 팀장 임득균이라고 합니다. 어, 저희 생각에는 지금 저희도 시작한 지 5개월밖에 안 됐기 때문에 인파먼트를 계속 진행하고 있거든요. 그리고 단체마당이라는 단체 자체가 인파먼트 잘돼 있고 그리고 의지가 있기 때문에 충분히 지속성이 있다고 생각합니다. 저도 호연 프로젝트에 대해 질문을 하나 하고 싶은데요. 온고작신 부분에 대해서 해외 국악기가 지속적으로 나오는 건지 궁금합니다. 예, 그 PT에서 나온 것처럼 부평 지역에는 50개의 풍물 단체가 있고요. 매년, 아 죄송합니다. 부평 지역에는 22개의 풍물 단체가 있고 매년 50개 정도의 해외 국악기가 한 단체에서 나옵니다. 그래서 추산한 결과 1100개 정도 나올 거라고 예상을 했고요. 이런 것들은 계속 연습하다 보면 계속 찢어지기 때문에 지속적으로 나타날 거라고 생각을 합니다. 네, 저는 호연이랑 금지 두 가지 다 관련해서 질문을 드리는 건데요. 아직 이제 뭐 액션은 그 플랜 플랜만 이제 뒤에 많이 서 있고 아직 액션은 그렇게 많이 하진 않으셔가지고 어, 그 결과를 이제 결과물을 저희가 좀알수 있는 게 없어서 혹시 지금 이제 공연의 이해도 60% 증가했다는 것 외에 네. 다른 뭐 숫자적으로 저희한테 좀 제시할 만한 게 있으신지? 아니, 지금 현재는 숫자로. 제시할 건 없습니다. 저희가 아직은 플랜 단계에 있는 게 많고요. 그렇기 때문에 내년 발표가 기대될 것 같습니다. <웃음> <웃음> 아, 그러면은, 예. 그러면은, 
한 가지 더 추가적으로 질문 드리자면 여기서 공연 이해도 60% 증가했다고 말씀하셨었는데 20%가 더 증가 예, 네, 어떻게 해서 네. 이거 측정을 하셨는지 저희는 설문조사로 진행을 했고요 일단은 불특정 다수로 진행을 했습니다 공연을 보러 온 사람들을 대상으로 했고요 물론 동일한 관객을 대상으로 한게 아니기 때문에 조금 문제가 될수 있지만 그래도 많은 숫자를 조금 표본을 잡아서 그래서 했기 때문에 조금 신뢰성이 있지 않을까 생각을 합니다 저희가 한첫 번째 거 100명 정도를 했고요 두 번째 거 150명 정도를 진행을 했습니다 네, 긍지에 대해서 질문을 하나 드리겠습니다 그 프로젝트를 이제 듣고 보면 명장에 대해서 깊이 있게 이제 도와주려는 어, 노력이 굉장히 어, 가슴에 와 닿았다 이렇게 생각을 하는데 우리 이넥투스 어, 이 Your time has expired. Just please join me in thanking Team 2 for their presentation and hard work. 감사합니다.